Hey, it's Chris. Thanks for joining me. In today's short video, I'm going to show you how to check the uh, coffee maker. The first step is to uh, unplug the coffee maker when you're not using it and put it well away from any power source if you can. Uh, the second part is to uh, now look at this uh, coffee maker and imagine a giant cross device is uh, starting to form over the top of it and encase the whole coffee machine. You can see the ice crossing over in your uh, imagination and visualize and uh, visualize it crossing over at the same time. The uh, next step, and you're still looking at the coffee maker, the real coffee maker, is to imagine that a replica of the coffee maker is uh, sitting on top of your head. Maybe just the uh, coffee jug, if you like. And then imagine that a cross device is crossing over the uh, replica of the coffee maker on top of your head. And it's crossing all the way down until just above the top of your eyes. Uh, the, third, the fourth part is to um, imagine putting a giant sombrero or a 10 gallon hat or whatever funny hat you like and then tie it underneath your chin in your imagination. So what we've now done is we've, we've used the image of ice, we've, we've placed the coffee maker well away from any, from any power outlet, we've frosted the coffee maker the ice will represent the cold, and the cold will is cold for us. That that represents that the coffee maker is off. You've put that information on top of your head by placing a replica of the coffee maker there, and you've frosted your head as well, which also tells you that the coffee maker is off. And you've put on a big sombrero or ten gallon hat. Now, when you're away from the house or you're away from the kitchen and you start to worry that the uh, coffee maker might still be on, all you have to do is remember that. Um, remember the vivid imagery that the coffee jug replica is frozen on top of your head. And that information will confirm to you that the coffee maker is off because you put that information on top of your head at the same time you were physically checking the coffee maker. I hope this makes sense. I'll leave the steps in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, uh, give me a thumbs up, give me a like. Uh, in the next video, uh, we'll carry on this theme of the coffee maker and we'll use the, a technique called uh, doubling up, which will um, it, it, it increases your memory power by uh, another by 100% uh, that, that the coffee maker is definitely off. Um, I'm, it's a bit, bit cryptic, I know, but in the next video, I'll explain what doubling up is. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next.